Good afternoon, CHS. Welcome to Pirate TV. I'm Diego. And I'm Trey. We have a fantastic show lined up for you today, packed with news, school spirit, and a little bit of Mr. Register. That's right, Trey. It was a short school week, but we still managed to get a show for you. So stay tuned, because it's all right, right here, here, right, right now, now, on, on Pirate, Pirate TV. TV. First up, let's talk about something you'll want to keep for a lifetime, the yearbooks. That's right, Diego. Yearbook sales are in full swing, and you don't want to miss out on capturing all the memories from the school year. Pirate Reporter Z has more for us. Miss True Love, along with her students, have been working on our new yearbook. I got the chance to interview Miss True Love about what the yearbooks have and what they try to include in it. In yearbook, we try to cover everybody as much as humanly possible, so we want to get all aspects of the student life. And that's in the building and out of the building. So we strive to cover all the clubs and all the games and all the various activities, career and tech classes, um, extracurriculars, and just student life in general. Make sure to keep a lookout for more info from Ms. Love. This has been Z reporting for Pirate TV. And remember, the earlier you buy, the more you save. Prices go up later in the year, so grab your yearbook now and get ready to flip through those pages for years to come. Speaking of memories, what better way to create them than by participating in our uh, Fall Spirit theme days? Yes, the coming weeks, we've got some awesome themes lined up to show off our school spirit. Diego, tell us more. Good afternoon, Pirates. As fall season approaches, it's time to gear up for our Fall Spirit days. Let's dive into the details. So Pirates, September 6th, wear your PJs. Just a reminder that this will be the only day that you can wear your PJs on the Spirit Days. On September 13th, the game theme is USA Patriotic, so make sure to wear red, white, and blue. Our homecoming game is on September 20th, so make sure to wear black and gold to represent our school colors. And remember, it's homecoming, so go all out. On September 25th, get creative with your friends, as the theme is rhyme without a reason. Blend in or stand out in the crowd during October 10th, as the theme is camo as we play Kaufman at home. As we face Ennis, wear pink as the theme for October 25th is pink out. For November 1st, will you be a mathlete or an athlete as this will be the theme for this day? And last but not least, on September 7th, we have a home game against Greenville and it's beach theme. Make sure to not miss out. So Pirates, let's make this Fall Spirit Day great. Make sure to stay in dress code and most importantly, have fun. I'm Diego reporting for Pirate TV. Now, they might not sell PJs or camel clothes, but the school store, The Shack, can help you supply with much needed school supplies and even some snacks. I met up with Mr. Register to give us some more insight. Hey everyone, we have some thrilling news that's sure to add a spark to your day. Your favorite teacher, Mr. Register, is stepping out of the classroom and into the spotlight with an exciting new venture. Get ready to welcome The Shack, a brand new shop that's about to become your go-to spot for all things awesome. Um, so I previously took this class last year and, you know, it was the best class I've ever had. So I took it in this year and now I'm in charge of the pirate shop. So we actually have new items this year. We have gum, popsicles, and a lot more to come. So I think those will be our best sellers this year. At the shack, Mr. Register is bringing his signature flair to a fantastic selection of products from must-have school supplies to unique gifts and fun gadgets. There's something for everyone, and that's not all. The Shack is constantly updating its inventory with fresh new items. You never know what cool new finds you'll come across each time you visit. Absolutely, so what we look for, we look at what the sales are. We've got to figure out what do our customers want, and we want to fulfill that demand. Therefore, we go find the products, we go find those things, we source them. As long as they're smart stack compliant, we're going to get them in the store for you, that way you have a great experience. Absolutely. So we have a form that's located at our store that you just simply scan with your QR code and let us know how we're doing. Let us know like if it's a one to a five, five to a ten star. What can we do to make your experience better? And by doing that, we get to listen to you. Your voice is heard when you come to the plank. Come on down. You're going to have a great time at our store. Don't miss out. Stop by the shack today and experience this excitement for yourself. Show your support for Mr. Register's latest adventure and find something you'll love. See you at the shack. Reporting for Pirate Productions, I'm Trey Padilla. I'll be ready to purchase some snacks for sure. And if you think your lady is a snack, this next segment is definitely for you. <laughs> Our school floor department is starting up their monthly floral arrangement program. Here's AG with more. Today, we're here with floor teacher Ms. Bailey, who will be giving us more insight onto her new student-run organization called Pirate Pedals. 
My name is Miss Bailey, and I am one of the floral design teachers here at Crandall High School. Pirate Petals is a business that Advanced Floral runs throughout the whole duration of the school year. They're able to see the whole process of ordering flowers, uh, making them, and delivering them to the customer. The whole purpose of Pirate Petals is that these students are able to get more hands-on experience with flowers, so eventually they're able to go out into the workforce and have these employability skills and all this knowledge on all the different designs. Pirate Petals doesn't just do our subscription every month. We also get the chance to help out with any um, weddings that people have signed us up for, or we actually make the homecoming flowers for the court and for the king and queen. We also do prom flowers for here at Crandall ISD and any other event that's really going on. If any of you are interested in Pirate Petals, scan the QR code below. I'm AG, back to you guys in the studio. Thanks, AG. Along with Pirate Petals and Spirit Day, we have a few other announcements. Yes, yeah, September 11th is Patriot Day, so wear your red, white, and blue as we pay tribute to all our first responders. And September 17th is National Voter Registration Day, and if you are 18 years old or older, you can register to vote during lunch on the 17th. Also, there's a college and career fair happening on September 19th. For juniors and seniors, be sure to scan the QR codes around the campus to register. Seniors, you can order your senior yard signs now through the graphic design class for only 20 bucks. Scan the QR code to enter. And, and homecoming, homecoming, homecoming. Tickets go on sale next week, September 9th through the 11th for upperclassmen, 12th through 20th for all students, and September 16th through the 20th for out of district. Tickets are $30 for CHS, $40 for out of district, Tickets will be sold at lunch and no tickets will be sold at the door. Semi dress code will be enforced and you must have your student ID to purchase a ticket and enter the dance. Cash or check only. Well, that's all for this week, Pirates. We have enjoyed our time with you. We'll see you next week and thanks for watching Pirate, Pirate TV. TV.